Good morning guys, welcome back to another juicy vlog and welcome to Saturday. It's rare that we're off together on a Saturday, isn't Very it? Rare, yeah. If you don't know, Lucy and I both work full time for companies, so Lucy works every single Saturday, so it's nice today. She's off for her laser eye surgery recovery, which happened in the last vlog, if you haven't seen that, go and watch it. Pretty intense, she gave a full review on her experience, but it is now the next day and she's doing good. Yes, as George said, I'm doing good. I woke up this morning and I could actually see, which is crazy. Uh, yesterday evening, my vision was still a little bit blurry, but overnight it's all like, I don't know if it's a word, like healed and got better. Um, I still can't wear any makeup or anything for a good few days on my uh, uh, my face, and then I can't wear eye makeup for like two weeks. I'm feeling normal again. I can't do any like activities or anything. I've got to wear sunglasses everywhere I go outside. My eyes still feel a little bit sensitive to the light, but I shouldn't complain about it being sunny, really, should I? So I wanted to start off today by showing you guys something that arrived for me here at Juicy Towers. And it is this. It is a company I'm working with at the moment called Maximum Style. And they've sent me a range of the products that they sell. And this is all men's grooming products. And to be honest with you, this couldn't have come out at a better time. For some reason, I have good skin generally, but for some reason at the moment, you can probably see, because this camera's such high quality. I've got like bumps, I, I don't know. I don't know what's going on, but anyway, this is good timing. Ooh, there's lots in here. So I'm working with them today on this video. They are sponsoring this part of the video, guys, and I'm also working with them on Instagram. So um, check out my Instagram. There'll be some cool posts of their products up very, very soon. And the reason I wanted to work with this company is because I think guys generally forget to look after their skin. I don't know if I'm generalizing here, but it's so common for women to have all these uh, beauty products and moisturizers and face creams and stuff like that. For some reason, men shy away from it. I I'm someone who doesn't shy away from it. If I don't moisturize my face in the morning, like it it's, it's bad news. So I thought I'd take you through the things they have sent me, oh, and sticker as well, um, today, and give you guys a bit of like a, oh, I love this, I'm using this already. Give you guys a bit of a morning routine for men really so they've sent me one two three four five products and this would have happened sooner but um they were waiting for their new website to be up and running and all designed and everything and the link is here and it's below this website looks so slick like if i was going to design a website this is what it would look like so i'm actually going to start off with this slick gorilla which is the powder i've been using already so when matt at maximum style asked me what powder i was using i i told him this and he was like great we we sell that we love slick gorilla um i'm going to do this i've dry I've washed and dried my hair this morning already, but I haven't put any product in it whatsoever yet. This is great stuff. I'm gonna show you how I use it. Oh, some falling out already. It smells good as well. I don't know if you're meant to put it in your hands, but how I do it, I just tip it straight on my hair. I kind of lean back and then just kind of use a finger and just tap it out. Bit on the top, little bit on the sides. And this is like, it leaves a really dry kind of matte finish. So then you literally have it in your hair. You just shake your fingers through it. That's all you do until can't see on this little screen if all the white powder's gone but that is all you do and you and it kind of stick that bit down a little bit can't really see because it's not a proper mirror i wouldn't say stiff but that is definitely providing a hold and i didn't even use much that one of those will last forever i was speaking to a friend of mine the other day he's been through so many different types of hair products and stuff and they've all been kind of wet and then halfway through the day your hair falls out and stuff this lasts all day it's dry it's a powder you just feel it through your hair looks and feels almost like it doesn't have product in actually big fan of that one saying that maximum style have sent me this uppercut matte pomade 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 it looks like a tub of car wax actually but let's give this a go because i've had this parting put in now i do need something a little bit stiffer that's gonna hold oh looks nice that's gonna hold it down Oh my God, I want to eat it. Loose. Yeah. this stuff smells so good. This stuff looks and smells incredible. It looks like, um, it looks like Angel Delight. Right, so I don't know how much I'm going to use here. I'm just getting a bit on my fingers, maybe like that much. I'm going to rub it in and then I'm going to try and use it to stick my parting down a little bit. Use a mirror behind me one sec. That's much better. I'm so happy with that. That, that is good stuff. That leaves, can't go over the smell. It leaves, um, it's not wet, it still feels good, but it just feels a little bit stiffer. Just to get, if you have a parting like me, it just gets that, it just sticks it down nicely. Oh, I think he sent me a razor. Although that does leave your hands quite sticky, so I'm gonna go and wash these. Smell this. It's unbelievable. You have to open it. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> that smells like the Christmas cookie Yankee candle, doesn't it? Oh yeah. Right, what do you want me to do? So, they sent me a razor. Sweet. And... Did you shave some... your head with it? <laughs> Some American, oh my God, did I tell you the time 
Have I told you guys the time when I tried to shave my No, arms? no, no. We're not doing it's this now. It's a different now. story. We're not doing um, this They've sent me some American crew <laughs> oh, shaving. And this is also very good timing, because as you can see here, I kind of shave, I shave. Let's swap sides. I shave this part of my neck. And I haven't done it for a few days, because you can see it's got longer. So let's try this out. It's American crew pre precision, precision shave gel and a Chrome Retro Morgans. I've heard of Morgans. A Morgan's Retro Blade. Sweet, let's do it. Let's open it. Wow. Oh my <gasps> God. That looks so cool. What, what the? Oh, how do wow, you... can I hold it? I don't know how you use that. That, oh, wow, it's heavy. That is the coolest thing. What, I want that how on display. I use, how do I use I it? I literally want that on display somewhere in the flat. <laughs> how do I use this? Okay, I need to work out how to actually use that razor, but we're gonna go for some of this American Crew Precision Shave Gel. So this is supposed to give me a really, really clean shave, which is exactly what I want under here. So let's give it a whirl. Okay, I'm actually so, I was, I was worried at first when I put it on because it doesn't lather up like other shaving foams I've used. It just looked like there was nothing on my skin. You've but, literally done that so easily and quickly. It's so quick. You've normally got to be like slow doing it and yeah. not cut yourself. That was just like glides that on. I was so n genuinely impressed with that. I want to work out how to do that other one later though because yeah, that we'll looks work so out good. Yeah, that looks so retro, doesn't it? Yeah. The final thing they sent me, and I've never used this and I'm really excited to try it out, is beard oil. How have you never used beard oil? I've never you've used got, it. You've had a beard for a while now. I know, but the thing is my beard doesn't grow here very well. It grows here nicely. Um, so I've heard beard oil helps with growth. Right, let's Not get sure some of this yeah. on. <laughs> Lucy would love for me to have a big cool beard. Sadly, I can't give her everything, but there is a lot Sorry. I can give her. <laughs> oh, so this is an FHM Grooming Awards beard oil by the Blue Beards Revenge. There's a company there, cool skull on the thing. Uh, yep, so what we're gonna use is this. It's blue, or is the bottle just blue? It won't be blue. And I guess you just tap a bit into your hands. Right, I'm not gonna use loads because I've never used it before. My beard's not that long at the moment. <laughs> You're like grabbing oh, it. Oh, it smells good. Can I smell you? You can smell my beard. I'm just gonna rub it through a bit on the old moustache. That looks good. It just looks kind of cleaner because it looks kind of dry normally. Oh, okay. Um, it just looks a bit better. I think you put a bit on your, too much on your face as well, huh? Yeah, I've got an oily face now. Great, uh, good. That's fine, that's fine. <laughs> Arm hair oil Oh, I've got it everywhere. It I've got it everywhere. So the only other thing I do as a morning routine is use a face scrub, but I'm not very good at using it. I only use it maybe uh, three times a week. I that's should, good. No, I you should, shouldn't do it every really? day. Really? Yeah. Okay, face scrubs two or three times a week. So um, yeah, guys, go check out Maximum Style. I've got a brand new website. Matt's a great guy who runs the company. Thanks, Matt, for my products. I'm definitely going to use these. We need to get to your appointment. Yeah, we're going to be late. As, as always, we're in a rush. Let's go. I've just dropped Lucy at her appointment. Should only be about 10 minutes, um, and it's in Hove. It's in Optimax again, where it was yesterday. I've parked in Tesco's delivery bay bit, which... I don't think is a thing, but I'm only staying here for literally a few minutes and there's no lorries. Obviously I'll move if I'm in the way, but after this, we're gonna head into town for a bit and go and buy some plain hoodies. Actually, I've got a plain hoodie here. I've got an old, well, not an old, I've got like actually my best black hoodie here. Lucy's gonna buy a plain hoodie or a plain t-shirt or something. We wanna make some clothing just for us to wear. We've like working up some designs and something around the do the thing motto that Lucy and I kind of have. Not a motto, it's just kind of a, like a little phrase that we keep using. We use it on Instagram and stuff, we use it in these videos. And the meaning behind that is just do the thing you love. That's, that's fully what we believe in, that's the message we push out on this channel, as you guys know. So we wanted to go and get a little design we've made, put on a hoodie. So we then need to find a shop that actually does that as well. Guys, I'm screwed. Lucy's taking the car key and the engine's gone off and I can't move it, and if a lorry comes, I need to move because I'm not in a good place at all. Uh oh, because on these BMWs, it's like, it's all wireless, and that's the start button, and it says, please, remote control missing, and it just won't start, nothing's happening. Oh my God. And she's already in her appointment. I'm gonna have to just hope for the best here, I think. I can't leave the car to go and get the key, because then I might get a ticket or something, or I might get clamped, or, this is, this is going to be bad. We're saved. We are saved. Yeah, you had the key. I know, yeah, I just seen your text. I was literally sat there talking to her, I your text and I was like, shit. Oh, it's fine. Like it. Yeah, we haven't been moved along. It's all good. Oh, I thought you said a lorry was here. No, I said if a lorry comes, we're screwed. Oh, you were like, there's a lorry here. Nah, we're all good. I need good. the key. Oh, if, if a lorry comes. Yeah, oh, if panic. a lorry comes. I need to panic. So how was your appointment? 
Um, fine. Um, they're a little bit inflamed. Okay. So instead of every four hours for the pink drops, I need to do them every two hours still. And as they're a steroid, they need to monitor me a bit closer. So I've got to go on my lunch break on Wednesday back in. After that, a week after probably. But they said it's fine. The red bits are fine. Oh, okay. Vision wise, I'm overdriving standard so I can drive, which is good. All right, um, swap seats then. No, I'm enjoying this and um, it's all good. Very quick. Sweet, Amazing. that's good news. So due to like um, risk of infection, I need to um, buy new makeup for when I can start wearing it again in the next few days. Um, so that's an excuse to go to Boots and get some new bits. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Lose this is the nicest ice cream shop in the world. Um, oh, well, I've never been there, but I hear good things. Jojo's Gelato. Do you want to get an ice cream? Oh, we're trying to be good, aren't we? That's the thing. I don't want an ice cream. Nah. All well, right. I do, but I don't want an ice cream. Okay, we love this. Oh, oh, oh sorry. Oh. Just elbowed you in the boob. Oh, that was like a really, <laughs> really like, solid one as well. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. We're oh. just going to say we love this part of town and we want to pick up Basically, I'm craving or vitamins. Because I feel what? like I haven't had enough who, vitamins. Who craves vitamins? Because I'm, I'm, I'm a patient. To be fair, I was really craving blue, gluten the other day. I'm a patient. No, you're not. You, you, it's done I'm, now. I'm you're good to drive. I'm Lucy's patient. milking this laser eye Obviously surgery would. stuff. Why wouldn't you? She totally, totally is. We're nearly at H&M where we're going to go in and find some plain clothing. Love it. Love to the buy. Basics. All and yeah, just gonna wander around. Then we're gonna right. try and get a drink of some sort. I was thinking of going to Six. Shop. There's no such thing as a oh, vitamin shop. Like miles out no, it's like green juices and stuff. No, I know what there's it a is. fresh, there's a fresh yeah, juice. They might do a nice drink. Yeah. There's a fresh juice um, place at the moment. Do you want to get it now? Well, yeah. I'll make All right. It after. Cool. It's after, Easter. after. All right. Yeah. Sorry. We'll come back. Also forgot to have my ginger shot this morning. If you see my Instagram story the other day, my mum's made me these like homemade ginger shots. They're all right, they're strong and they burn your throat. But the re yeah, sure. The reason I've got them is um, they're good for hay fever apparently. So we're sampling some materials for our hoodies. <laughs> How do you think this looks with this dress? Oh, it looks amazing. It looks really so is? good. That's, That's good for size. Look. That's just, we can both use that. We're thinking of getting like a black and one of this colour, maybe like a hoodie and a t-shirt. Just literally for us to wear. Come into Food Dillick, which is a really nice place for healthy food, because we're being healthy. And the avocado stuff, please. Thank you very much. I love the chicken as well, please. Gravy, uh, Yeah, a little bit, please. Thank you. View of the green juice. So, what's in it? Apple. Spinach, apple, lime. I have no idea. Lime and, and some other healthy stuff. How is it? It's good. It's only four ingredients, and it's also inspired us to. We've just popped to Sainsbury's and we've bought loads of stuff because we've got a Nutribullet and we don't use it enough. We, like, the only reason I use it is to grind up cashew nuts to put in noodles. So that's literally the only reason. Yeah, we've bought a load of healthy veggie, and we, when we do them, we try not to put too much fruit in it because it's like really bad for your teeth having that much sugar. So the only fruit we've got is actually pineapple, right? And then like carrot, spinach, yeah. gingers at home. Yum. Right, we yep, need to flip home and eat. <gasps> the last one. Do you want a nice coffee? Only Say no. I really want one. You really want one? <sighs> There's only one capsule no, left. How is there only one? There were like four in there earlier. Because we used two this morning. As soon as it gets past May, iced coffee is my thing. Tiny bit of vanilla syrup and we're done. Iced coffee is without a doubt the work fuel, the editing fuel, the planning fuel of choice at the moment. We mentioned in a video recently that Lucy and I are working on something big and it is big. If you thought the last project was, was big, that was nothing. That's old news. 
this is big, 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 big. And all will be revealed a lot sooner than the last one took, so it's very cool. Something's on its way. Start dropping a little, little something just to, you know. Mm -hmm.